Thanks. Welcome back to the Bill Yonka Show. I'm Bill Yonka, joined by Carl Maronich and Uncle Paul. Uncle Paul's passing out Carl's for today's edition of As the Clod Turned. We'll hear that Carl's in a little while. Actor, you know. and Carl's done this before. We have two, um, well, two people who haven't done it before with us. They've done this sort of thing before. It's not a big deal. Um, Beth Ashmore and uh, Brooke Clubs. Both here. Um, Beth is the one who keeps up to date with all the all well, things bill. Very good. Let's go ahead and do yeah, that. Yeah, we can do that right now. Okay. Oh no. Now. Go ahead. Yeah, you can. You can just hold that, or you can. Okay. Okay. Beth is uh, a librarian and also the one who keeps up to date with the allthingsbill.org, so thanks for doing that. Sometimes better than others. Sometimes right. I'm not as yeah, good. You're a little behind. Yeah. You're, you're yeah. a great job with that. That's Thank impressive. you, Carl. And it, she just like she just reads my mind. I don't have to like give her any instructions. Just oh, that's perfect. That's exactly what I would. That's want. pretty light reading, isn't it? <laughs> it is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but it's because um, it's because Bill's dad and my mom shared a womb. They're twins. Ooh, so right. yeah, that that does help. We get like maybe like a one tenth of that twin connection or something being being cousins. So. And I have to thank Lori and Chance who are recording the show today since oh, I'm here. Oh, Lori and Chance. Yeah. Oh, so it gets. Recorded. That's good. Yeah. We're hot. Yeah. Is this today a good show? I haven't. I don't know yet. <laughs> Have you been listening to it? <laughs> no. No. You yeah. Yes, it has been. It's been a great show. <laughs> it's always a good show. Uh, thanks. Now you see that we it isn't sound effects when you hear the farmers market shopping cart. No, it's all real. It's authentic. People stopping by. Carl is questions. not a robot. He is a no, real man. Well, thank you. I don't have women tell me that often, so thank you. I appreciate hearing that. Except for Mrs. Carl. She yeah, yeah. Uh, not, not often enough. That's another matter. This is, you know, while Beth records the show every week, she doesn't ever see you. Actually, well, no. I know this is the first time I've ever seen Carl in yeah. person. Although I do, I have seen the lovely picture of you and Ronald McDonald. Oh well, thank you. Yeah, that's a special one. Yeah. <laughs> And you, you, you said it originally. And I think I missed you were here from where? Um, I live in Birmingham, Alabama, but oh. I grew. I was born here, and right. I grew up in Springfield. Okay, Illinois. Yeah. Ah, very yeah. good. So. And where? where is Birmingham? Did you say Alabama? Yeah, Birmingham, Alabama. Lovely. I work at Stanford University, a school oh. you've probably never heard. No, of. I have a Stanford, in California. I've heard of that one. No, no. <laughs> See, that's my theory that Stanford was just named that so they get the overflow from Stanford. Stanford. Yeah. 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 So they yeah. get the bad spellers. Yeah, the bad spellers. Sanford and Son, I've heard of that. Yeah. 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 And uh, you might wonder if she came from Alabama, if she had a banjo on her knee, but that banjo was surgically removed ah, okay. yes, before she true. left. Yeah. Down the Smithsonian or so almost healed up. How long have you been down in Alabama? Um, I have been there for about, gosh, almost eight years now. Oh, okay. And before that, she was at Mississippi State University. Oh, yeah. So you're, you're I went from one girl. bulldog to another bulldog. So. Uh, she's always a bulldog. I'm always a bulldog. Which always. one has more books? <laughs> <laughs> That's our first question. Mississippi State um, or Samford? Well, Mississippi State has a lot more books. Because and it's um, a does it have more books that are colored in? Uh, yes, it does. And more pop-up books. books? Right, okay. right, yes. Because, you know, they got money. It's land grant, you know. Oh, Those egg oh, kids, yeah. they need the pop-up yeah. book where the corn, you know, really shoots oh. out at you, you know. Yeah, they play big-time football there, too. That's right. Yeah, That's basketball. right. They got the cowbell. Do you get free tickets to that? Uh, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> you know, anything for employees. Old Miss. Old no, no, it's Mississippi not Old State. Miss. Mississippi oh. State. Yeah, we. It's the other one. Okay, we, Dennis, make me look bad now. No, no, I didn't. We both claim to be Harvard of the South, though. Oh, <laughs> oh that which is uh, like world's tallest midget. There's no, there's no school in Illinois called Old Ill. No. How can we, I mean? Is that like its real name, by the way? No, it's it's actually the University yeah. of Mississippi. Oh. Okay. But everyone, and I mean everyone, they just calls call it Old Miss. And that's without a D, that's with an E, right? That's correct. Oh, Ole Miss. Ole Miss. Or in Minnesota, that would be Ole Miss. <laughs> yeah, hey. Yeah. Yeah, there. And uh, Bill, so so we, we, we talked about all the microphones away and from Bill, so if you could see, he's getting a little nervous. <laughs> we're going to get another gesture soon if we're not careful, I think. It, it is time for uh, the top of the hour. Oh, it's the, station, the, the station ID, the news. I think we'll do another edition of the Sportsman's Letter. So if you're wondering... Where to go fishing today? Keep it tuned right here at Talk AM 1320 WKAN. I'm Bill Yonker. We'll be right back.